what is the difference between a pregnant woman who had vaginal delivery and came out alive with her baby and the one that had her baby through CS and also came out alive with her baby. You know, this misconception about CS and the way religion has brainwashed so many people, especially Africans. This Nigerian doctor, Dr. Penking, explains how a woman lost her womb simply because her pastor told her to avoid CS. She was going to have her baby through normal delivery. So he said... She had an obstructed labor. The doctor on call decided on CS. She said that her pastor told her that she would deliver, like the Hebrew women. And besides, they don't used to do CS in her family. She asked to be taken to church. She was later rushed back to the hospital. And when she was finally rushed back to the hospital, she already had uterine rupture with total myometrial and serosal disruption baby was floating in the peritoneum dead uterus was bleeding like an ocean and could not be repaired it was removed the child was her first child she lost her first child and lost her womb for life you see wow just like that i believe in giving birth as a hebrew woman abby but once life is involved and you are being given another option to save you as a pregnant woman and that of your child my advice is do not hesitate as far as you will come out alive that pregnant woman will come out alive and the baby still come out alive all of them are safe delivery if they are counting women that delivered like hebrew women you are a mongo count yourself the same god that said hebrew women is still the same god that created all these doctors and put that brain into them to know when to tell you to stop pushing to know when to tell you it is time to do the needful so don't allow religion to be cloud sense of judgment your sense of judgment and reasoning women believing that cs is a bad thing cesarean section is a bad thing is a bad omen is this is this i beg which part of the country which part of the planet did you come from a good and real pastor will sit you down and lecture you my dear once you reach this level you reach this stage do the needful the white men that brought this christianity to africa does not joke with their lives they don't play with their lives but one person sitting at the back of your house one pastor will come and be telling you say, bah, 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 bah. let's play let's play let's play life is getting out of you one by one bit by bit in every dying minute every second before you know the person don't buy the person don't die all in the name of my pastor told me not to do it all in the name of in fact eh, i think it's high time africans wake up wake up from sleep and slumbers like the doctor said the woman said in their families they don't do cx like now who they born for this life come mountain like put them permanent say yes cs is for you nobody it is circumstance circumstances that push them into doing that because they want to save their life they understand that they need to stay alive for that child that baby okay now she's alive she has lost her womb the first child is no longer there. Paraventure, she married someone that doesn't even care. That, hey, if you don't give me that baby, you are on your own. No, The man will still go behind her or even in her very before and give another woman belly. Yes, so impregnate another woman. Uh-huh. The family will even side him. They will back him. Yes, so. And they will tell you, oh, madam, see now. With the man cannot I cannot die without a hair, without a child. At least someone needs to represent him. And she will not do anything. Now she lose last last. Before you know it now, depression don't enter. And if depression enter, the pastor will even tell him, say, avoid CX. They want back here they enjoy it in family. If you say don't burn five, don't burn four, don't burn three, don't burn, you understand. So what's the need if you cannot save yourself to be happy? Your life first. Do not do not allow someone to determine what will happen in your life. Women need to start doing better. And I think Africans especially need to be lectured properly and allow the doctors to do their job to save their lives. When CS becomes an option to save them and that of their unborn child, I'm just tearing up like when i read this i in fact eh, i i was like ah god oh, just like that woman ju- just like that though that's how she could just deal with that bikino hey it is real anyways with that being said that brings me to the end of this video 
please guys this is sladly woman on court remember to subscribe and turn on your notification bell to always get notified anytime i drop new videos if you're watching for the first time thank you for tuning in you're most welcome and to my tiny subscribers of course you all know that this video can never be complete without me appreciating you guys thank you for watching liking and commenting um love you guys to the moon and back i had to plenty bye bye for now as i'm signing out for my next one please do give this video a massive massive thumbs up peace out love you all